Hello, my hearties, a very good evening to you. It's just me, Scotty McClue, and a very, very warm welcome to our random pop-up live this Tuesday evening, Tuesday the 16th of January 2024. Lovely to have you with us, and I am so glad that you could make it. Welcome, 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 I say. Always a privilege and never a chore. That's what it's all about, dinky do. Come and join us as soon as you possibly can and tell us what's happening with you. I hope that your evening is going well. There's the wonderful Richard. Richard Dinky Do, thank you so much for all your kindness and all your beautiful red roses. I think we'll end up making the goal, guys. Richard has very kindly put 10 red roses into tonight's goal. Is that not just such a beautiful thing to do? There's the wonderful Alan McGee. Good evening, Scotty. Do you ever wash the bonnet? Of course, Alan. They're clean regularly every 25 years, whether they need it or not. Evening, Scotty. Hope you're well. Red Rose Radio, great days. Oh, Macca. Red Rose Radio, January. Could you imagine it? So this would be 1993 if we were there 31 years ago. Uh, good evening, Scotty, says the wonderful Susan. Good evening, Susan. I'm so glad you could join us. And a very, very warm welcome. Say dinky do, Scotty McClure. I will, Shannon Riding. I will say dinky do to you, not a problem. Scotty, it's me, it's Becky from Liverpool. Becky, we love the bones of you in Liverpool. How lovely to have you with us. Thank you. Fantastic. Finley, dinky do. So there we are. That's very, very kind of you. Uh, now, who have we got here? Missy's just joined us, and user 617 has joined us as well. The wonderful Frank McElroy joins us. Good evening, Scotty. Long time, no chat. Far too long, but Frank, we were chatting on the live the other night. Were we not with the ch chat on the chat? What did you have for tea tonight? Becky, I had a Scottish lawn sausage and an egg. Is that not absolutely lovely, Dinky Doo? Thank you, Claire. Let me join, says Random. Random, you have joined. Uh, fantastic. That's what it's all about. What did you have for dinner tonight? Was it the mince and tatties? No, no, as I say, the lawn sausage, you know, a bit naughty. Favourite food? Well, I would say, Olivia, anything edible is my favourite food. And we say thank you. That's what it's all about. Follow us as soon as you can, guys. Scotty, how art thou, my brethren? Eddie boy, my brethren. Lovely to have you with us from Newmarket in Cambridgeshire. Am I right? Newmarket is actually in Cambridgeshire itself. There we go. Olivia has followed. Thank you, Olivia. That's very, very kind of you and very, very much appreciated. Hope everybody's enjoying the lives. And uh, do tell us. Get commenting, of course. Get following. Uh, what do you think of the First Ministers? Oh, well, we'll not go into all that on here, I think. No, Scotty, not been in one of your lives for a while. But uh, do comment on your downloads. Aha! Well, there you're on the live right now, Frank. Wonderful. Uh, not sure, Scotty, but I know Newmarket comes under Suffolk. Ah, quite right. Yes, you've corrected me. Liam is sending lightning bolts. Liam, that's so very, very kind of you. Thank you for your lightning bolts. I said to you, Dan has followed us live. Guys, everybody follow. We should have at least one million followers by now. Tut, 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 tut. About 250 million have actually watched the lives on TikTok. So there's no reason not to be commenting, I say to you. Uh, what have we got here on the YouTube chat? Of course, always lovely to have you with us on the YouTube. Did you get the notification? Uh, thank you. Eddie Boy. <laughs> AFK is talking to you on here. It's wonderful. Frank says, not been here long, Scottish. You know, early morning for work. Frank, I know, early morning myself. Absolutely. Whereabouts in Scotland are you from? All of it, Finn. But no, West Coast. West Coast here, I say. But when we were on Scott FM, it was East Coast and West Coast. Scotty, are those pictures in the back of you? They are. Well, that's Lord Reith the Labrador. Sadly, no longer with us. But what a beautiful guy. And uh, I've got to be with him there because it's his graduation. 
Can you see him? And um, that's me, the other one as well. And there we've got a lovely bit of decoupage done by the loveliest, loveliest lady, Bella from Bothwell. Do we remember Bella on the phone-ins? And somebody told me that sadly Bella had now passed away, an absolute princess of a lady. Walter is sending me lightning bolts. Walter, you're so kind. Thank you guys for all your kindness. It's a lovely, lovely thing to do, I'd say to you. Now, uh, who have we got here? Um, Ams. Ams has just joined. Did you do Ams? How wonderful is that? There's Amy. Hey, Scotty and everyone. Did you do Amy? How lovely to have you with us. And a very, very warm welcome. Hi, Scotty. Has the Scottish accent been diluted? Recently, my visits suggest. So what do you think? The, the Scottish accent in general, are we asking? I miss the Scotty long time no see. Ryan, how lovely to have you with us. It's great to see so many people turning up from the past and the present. Are you proud of being Scottish? I can't think of anything that would make me prouder. Do you know what I mean? It's just, I mean, you can't choose, uh, you know, where you're going to be from. Hello, Scotty from Busby, says Walter. Walter, what a fine part of the world. I wonder if the hat was called after Busby. There we are, Busby Railway Station. Now, I seem to remember there's a little junction comes over the back road from Chateau Ole into Busby. You have to be awfully careful emerging from the junction. Am I right? Do you remember our conversations on Ricky Fulton? Yes, I do, Ryan. A very fine man, uh, Ricky, uh, and a big Scotty McClue fan. And I, of course, was a massive, massive Ricky Fulton fan. Uh, from Ian Sturgeon's Finn, sorry, Anne Struther. We say Anne Struther, but I think, am I not right, Finn? The locals call it Inster. Uh, there we are, there's Angry Pigeon. Hello, Scotty, hope you're well, big lad. Are you enjoying this lovely crisp weather? A wee bitty cool in the morning for me yet, I have to say. But we wrap up warm. R.I.P. Bella, says the wonderful J.D. J.D., absolutely. A fine lady and a super collar. No photo of you, Scotty. Uh, the photo of you, Scotty, was that back in the Grampian days? Uh, no, the Grampian days was even younger. That's Red Rose Radio. That one through the black and white one is Red Rose Radio. The color one is round about the same time, actually, I think. Yes, very narrow road, very big houses as well. Indeed. Yes, it did. You've got to watch yourself on the bridge, the wee narrow bridge coming down from. Now, what's the village? Don't tell me. Don't tell me. Uh, to see if I can remember the name of the village. Um, just when you're coming down there, lovely, lovely wee village uh, in East Renfrewshire. Is it East Renfrewshire or is it in Glasgow? And it's called Kermanach. Am I right? Kermanach. Uh, so there we go. Follow us as soon as you can. Oh, Busby is very, very swish. I tell you, Busby and clerks and oh, ah, he's French for sure. And yes, Walter, right. So Karmanak, I've got the right village and it's East Ren. Thoughts on Bonnie Rig. I love Bonnie Rig. Did they not used to publish one of the newspapers out at Bonnie Rig? I'm sure they did. Now, what was the newspaper that was based at Bonnie Rig? And you've got the old mines round about there and you've got the Lady Victoria Colliery at Dun Dunkeith. Am I right? Dunkeith. All that wonderful quality. East Lothian. Big, big mining. Big, big fishing. You know, uh, the steel mills you had there. Did they not used to make the steel wire out in, uh, in East Lothian? Uh, does anyone remember Busby's nightclub in the old Butlands? Oh, yes. Does anybody remember Busby advertising a well-known telephone company? Busby. So there are, we used to talk about Busby. How much is Busby this month? <laughs> ha 
Fantastic. We love that. Uh, was that the Red 